<laughs> but you're dressed like you're going to Hawaii, which is cool. Yeah, like I had to... I just wanted to pop out, you know? Yeah. Against oh. the black screen, you got the memo, we didn't. Oh. <laughs> I'm, a f I'm a floating head on the black screen, it's nice. It'll make for a fun I visual, I think. I think, all think. The, everyone will just look here, which is, which is probably most... Uh, it most looks right. like she's going on a date, which is cool. It oh looks like God, I, stole, I stole a boyfriend's, uh, like, How much oversized. Cool is that, <laughs> How much cool is that? Anyway. Anyway. Okay, tough one right off the bat. You can't pick anything from this movie. But what is your favorite Mission Impossible stunt to date? Oh, that we're not a part of. Are you sure, the stunt that we watched. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I mean, the skydiving, you know, with Tom and uh, Henry Cavill was mind blowing. Oh, so so that, of that was so cool. Yeah, and you're a skydiver yourself, aren't you? Yes, yeah, so, like, I, I would yeah. love to go with him to do that. I do you know what I remember because before I went, before I met them for Fallout, uh, Tom and Chris. I then did a binge of all the missions because I thought I have to be able to remember it. Like they referenced three, what exactly happened there. So I studied every lizard notes. And do you know what the one that really does is the free solo climbing. That <gasps> makes me feel, because then yes. there's a great documentary, Free Solo. And yeah. when I watched that documentary, I thought, but Tom was doing that in the movie, in the mission movie years ago. So yeah, that to me, that made me feel ill with how scary it was. Yeah, and he really did so do good. it. He did parts of it. Mm -hmm. completely without any wires or anything. I thought, Crazy. I don't know. You, you can always tell when the stunt is done right when you actually feel unwell watching someone. Oh my God, I know, know, right? I know, it's true. Like in this one, when he the, the motorcycle goes off the cliff and then the camera goes over the cliff, I felt unwell. <laughs> yeah, it was, yeah, it, especially in the IMAX screen, you do just kind of like, Ugh. Yes. Um, have you heard about the Tom stunt double viral image? No. Okay. What is it? So I'm going to show you an image and you have to tell me which one it is, is the real Tom Cruise. Okay. Okay. <gasps> oh my God, stop it. There is only one. And is there one or not? Are they all fake? No, it's not him. It's not it's all him. Like a, I think left, if it's anything, like, on the left, if it was. But I think that's a no, trick, naughty question. No, it's, a, it's like a, a mix of Tom and someone else. It's sort weird. Sort of like also Chris Pine also like... Chris Pine! I know <laughs> these, I've met these people. Right? I've, I've crossed paths with these people, but who are they? I, I mean, none of them, but maybe, maybe, maybe on the left. It, it looks like this kid oh, that... It's gone viral as Tom Cruise's stunt double, and you have to pick which one it is, but they're all AI. All AI? That's so yeah. scary. It, they were, the image was created by AI, and I was like, Tom Cruise plus stunts plus AI. Mm -hmm. Perfect. I mean, that you have you sort of know it's AI, though, don't you? Because if they were, if they were actual real people... They'd be known for being so, looking so similar, but not. And also, would they really be a stunt double? They'd be a stat, wouldn't it? Mm -mm. Do you know what I mean? Plus, Tom doesn't have a stunt double. Exactly. <laughs> that is a trick question in itself. How do we not, how do we not realize that straight away? When you get the script for a Mission Impossible movie, how excited are you for the potential stunts you've got to be in? Or are you skimming through the script immediately to go, I mean, how much danger am I in? It's not really like about getting a script. It's just about getting the phone call. Mm. Are you ready? To be, to to be joining us for Mission Impossible. So that's a phone call. It's basically like in the movie, you know, when he gets, you know, a message like that 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 is going to self destruct in five seconds. It's the same thing, you know. Basically, you're a spy, you know. I wonder, because of Tom's presence in these movies, would that push you into doing more action than maybe you would? You'd be like, no, I'm gonna let the stunt double do that. But if you see Tom's having a blast doing stunts, would you be like, I'm gonna do that too? I don't know anyone wants to, I think everyone would want to do their own stunts as much as possible, right? I mean, I love to train as much as possible. I love to learn new skills. I love to push myself, so I want to do everything. So sometimes even the fight coordinator was like, okay, Palm Cruise, I'm like, no, don't call me that, but I want to do all my own stunts. <laughs> Give me more. So I kept pushing for more, you know, I just are hungry. And of course, getting to work with Tom, it makes you even more want to pu push yourself and bring your A game, you know? And final one, um, movies like this make me very frustrated that the Academy Awards have not given any attention whatsoever to the stunt side of these movies because it kind of falls between the gaps of production and producer and film where it's it just it's people are literally putting their lives on the line to entertain us and it does get kind of overlooked uh, and i think there should be like a concerted oscars for stunts campaign so i was wondering what your thoughts were on that i was actually thinking about that as i fell asleep last night i thought of wade eastwood who is the stunt um yeah, so director, coordinator. coordinator on this and the previous ones. <clears throat> and I thought, you know, 
I know him so well for years. We all know him really well. You see how he works day to day. Then you watch this movie and you think, how on earth did they conceive of it, let alone pull it off? Mm -hmm. And you've got someone that's responsible for all of those things. Yeah. And when they go, right, we kind of want this kind of stunt, yeah, and they develop it, he has to carry it out and make it happen. Yeah. And from, you know, even coordinating every grab on the train when they're hanging off the carriage to make it look real. You know, one wrong grab and you'll be like, oh, that, a human couldn't do that. Mm. Do you know what I mean? So I just think he's an absolute hero. I think he should win an Oscar for sure. Wait. For sure. I mean, I mean, like Tom should have won an Oscar anyway for any of his roles, but you know, that's a different story. <laughs> absolutely, absolutely. Listen, thank you so much for taking the time to talk to me today. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. None of our lives can matter more than this mission. I don't accept that. Come on.